my friends, welcome back. You keep asking me all the time to do some fun penetration test. And that's exactly what we're gonna do today. So we bought a lot of cool things. And if you have seen my video with the Francisca X, we had the shield, helmet, and the legit chain armor. So today we're gonna try it against my favorite throwing knives, the Vengeance by Arma Epona. We will start first from the small things and get to the bigger ones. In the end, I actually want to try put the chain armor over the meat and let's see what damage we can make. So, let's get started. I'm a little bit rusty, so let's make a varma first. Alright, I think I'm good to go, so let's start first with this cheap energy drink. They are not good for you. Let's destroy it. And for the video I'm gonna be using my favorite technique as well. No spin. <laughs> this one I actually missed guys, but look at that. It got stuck in the pneumatic. Wow. But I gotta hit this. Not exactly the direct hit, but the can got smashed. That's way better. Look at that. Totally direct hit in the middle, and they are not that easy actually to hit it. Hit that. Woo! Both sides. Nobody is going to drink this cheap energy drink. Let's move next. And now we have this cheap ballistic check gel, the cabbage, in the size of the head. So I actually want to try how the vengeance will go deep. So check it out, guys. Look at that guys, a little bit on the left side, but look at that, it can go all over, look, look how deep, and it's still thick, you know, I can't even pull it out, seriously, that's crazy, it's totally stuck in there, pretty crazy. Guys, I can seriously can't put it out of the cabbage. I will use the Francisca X. <laughs> That's better. Look at that. <sighs> okay. And now the pumpkin, which has definitely stronger skin than the cabbage. Let's find out what can do our knife. Actually, you can see the knife went here and look at that. It went like this and split the upper part of the pumpkin and it had totally no chance. We definitely have to move to something thicker. And now the hard coconut. Look at that guys, this is like from some kind of 
commercial on the bounty or something like that. Look at that. We totally split it open. That looks beautiful. The upper part. And you can clearly see that it went through the tough part of the coconut. And here is the tip. So actually all over the coconut. Wow. Very cool. Look at this entry hole. Pretty insane. Very nice. And now we have this reproduction of the Roman shield. It's a cheap version, but the plywood, it's still thick. So I'm wondering if the knife can penetrate behind the shield. So let's try it. I will try to aim on the right side of the shield. Check it out. problem at all here we have the hole from the Francisca if you remember but look at that here is the hole from the throwing knife it went definitely inside but it would be really cool to test it on some proper legit shield I definitely want to make it in near future but this gives you idea that if you're gonna wear some cheap plywood shield it's gonna not protect you at all. Let's move on. And now we have the helmet that I also tested with the Francisca and I tried to bash it last time with the full force and it didn't crack. So I'm wondering what will happen if I will throw my knife on it. But like I said, it's pretty thick. So I'm wondering what will happen. In any case, it's going to be also test for the throwing knife if it was something happened with the tip or not. So let's check it out. Wow, look at that guys. I think it was the really good throw because it went straight with the point. Let's check it out first, the point first, look at that. Totally no damage on the knife like a brand new. Let's see the helmet. Look at that guys. So, do we have some penetration? I think I actually hit the most thickest part of the helmet, right in the middle, exactly right in the middle. So I think I will try to one more throw, but now on the less protected the side. But I think this helmet should stop it. We will see, let's go. insane look at that guys so first went here again stuck in the pneu but look at that like I said before this part was the most protected because there are some kind of welding or something like that but look at that we went totally through there will definitely left some mark look at that it looks like from almost 9 millimeter maybe 22 millimeter but we definitely got inside into the helmet and it would left definitely some bad mark. Wow, that's pretty insane. Pretty cool. But now we have the meat and the chain armor. Come on. So normally you would have the chain armor on you and you would be protected only with one layer. But what we did here, look at that. We put the meat behind the chain armor. So it's actually now protected with two layers. Let's find out what will happen. No way, guys. I totally thought that I missed. Because look at that. I think I hit only the wood. But look, the knife went easily through the chain armor. It actually got hit, the meat. And now I think it's actually really stuck. And look at that. That's insane. Look, through the chain armor, through the meat, and through the wood. What? That's insane. 
I have to make at least one more throw. If that was just just luck or some kind of misplaced. Crazy! The first one actually was stopped by the chain mail. Let's see what happened here. So again, both layers, both layers penetrated and look at that. This is what happened in the Francesca episode as well. The chain armor is now actually stacked inside of the meat. That's brutal. Look, and even the knife, of course. Ah. Nasty, nasty. And maybe it didn't went through because we actually also hit the bone. Insane. Wow. Insane penetration. So as you were able to see today, guys, if you have right technique and throwing knives, you can destroy everything that's in your way. But Definitely don't try this at home. Rather stay in your normal practice, have a fun and keep training classic throwing techniques. And if you want the same throwing knives as I use today, the Vengeance model, they are now up for sale on the Arma Epona section sharp blades. But for today, that's it. So thank you one for watching, share, like, comment, subscribe and See you next time.